Hey guys, Bryce here from Nautical T4R. Uh, I was going to show you guys today my rack that I have going on. It's uh, from LFD Off-Road. Uh, I'm going to show you guys what's going on. I've had it on for about four months now. Uh, I got it from a website online uh, from Facebook. i uh, just uh, going to show you guys around, kind of give you my first impressions of it. All right, here you go. So right now we got this guy right here. This is the rack. I didn't get the full rack, I got the 7 8 rack and it is aluminum. Uh, like I said, it didn't take too bad to install it. All it really takes is just these four bolts right here. Uh, mounts in the factory, factory mounting hardware from there. Uh, it's got a good rail system on it. Uh, it's fairly modular, you guys can see it. Uh, just kind of pretty basic. Nothing too spectacular. Uh, as you guys can see, I have a rifle box installed right here. Uh, just kind of as a storage thing, use it for like recovery stuff. Uh, I got some ratchet straps in there as well. Um, just kind of going from there. But uh, overall, it's pretty good. Rack holds up pretty well. You can't really tell any wind noise on it. Uh, it's nothing too crazy. Uh, again, I didn't really get the full rack. Uh, the one that I was looking at, uh, I got from a guy online, uh, secondhand. So it was pretty good. Uh, again, not really a full rack. It only has just a, like six or so inches shorter than that. Uh, it's nothing too bad, but still pretty good rack uh, for what it is for the first rack I ever had for this thing. Uh, as you guys can see, it goes all the way to the back. Uh, it doesn't really block anything either, and it actually has these rails, which are really cool uh, because you can actually adjust uh, if you loosen the nuts on the inside. If you loosen the nuts on the inside, you guys can actually take these and slide them back and forth to give you a little bit more maneuverability uh, as far as um, being able to uh, connect things to here a little bit easier. Um, I had to move them around a little bit when I had to install my box because uh, the rails were a little too close together, so I had to open them up just a bit, uh, but it wasn't too crazy. Uh, overall, I like it so far. Uh, once I get a little bit more into it, uh, I'll give you guys a better understanding and a better uh, description of how I feel if we need to change the thing or what the likes and dislikes are. Cool. Uh, yeah, so that's pretty much it. Uh, if you guys like what you saw here, then go ahead and uh, just continue to watch. Other than that, we'll see you guys next time. Thanks.